and all the filthy, disgusting lies that the Israelis told after October the 7th. Like what? And you said that Eric said that he sees me waking up in tears. Uh, I do. I am prepared to admit mm. that I am in tears over Gaza every morning mm. when I wake up because I, I'm only 80 years old. I have never experienced the genocide of a whole people in front of my eyes happening every day, every day. The calumny. Well, you have. The sl well, with respect, you have. You were born in World War II when there was an actual genocide of Jewish people by the Nazis. I was that big. What? I, I was that big. I didn't witness that. Yeah, you were alive, that. is my point. Well, but that's, I wasn't talking about being alive. I'm saying I never witnessed it. And all the filthy, disgusting lies that the Israelis told after October the 7th. Like what? About burning babies and women being raped, which were all completely... Actually, women were raped. No, they weren't. Yes, they were. Well, there's no evidence. It's been, well, it's been established by the you United Nations. You can say Nations. anything that you want, but there's no evidence. But actually, there is extensive evidence. There is no evidence. Sexual assault and right. rape. Well, there is. Okay, well, all right now. Also, we know what happened.